Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of the Minecraft fan server. We are down here in the nether because I have done a bit of work on uh, on little things I've been doing uh, around here in the nether and at my castle. But uh, let me show you guys this, the one, one of the things I've worked on. Um, I was tired of walking from here all the way 400 blocks to my portal. Um, that became a pain in the ass and I decided, hey, we might as well make a railway system. I think that would be the best thing to do. I think I mentioned this in one of my last episodes, but anyways, I got it done. Um, so let me show you guys this here. Uh, let me update you guys on, on, on some stuff. Um, I've My apology for not uploading a video in a, in a while now. Um, I have actually think I'm coming down with laryngitis. My throat hurts like a bitch, but uh, I'm feeling a little better today. So I thought I might as well record, record something. So uh, anyways here, this is what you're seeing right now. Um, I kind of devised a, a, a way to to have stops and stations like this, like this. That's Jason's place, but in order to get there, you have to loop around um, from my place. So I'll show you guys this in, in a second. I'm pretty sure it's pretty sure it's coming up here in a sec. Um, but anyways, uh, I've done like I said, I was doing some work on my castle. Um, I finally got that courtyard thing completed. Um, let me show you guys that. I still need to clear out some stuff and. Uh, I kind of want to add a little bit more detail to the courtyard. I was doing some thinking on that. So this is uh, pretty much the station idea. Um, what it does is you come up here and then these these two um, unpowered unpowered uh, rail railway thingamabobbers, um, they, they stop you. And then once you hit the button, um, that releases the cart and makes the whole thing go. Um, so I don't know. I, I think that's the best way you can possibly make it. Uh, at least that's what I think. Um, but, anyways, here. Uh, okay, so let's move along here. Uh, so let me show you guys my courtyard. Um, I've got the floors, the two floors done. I got the roof done, but I still gotta add all the other walls and stuff. Uh, let me show you guys this. Uh, let's see here. Um, so this is it right here. I added the windows. I added all the uh, all the fancy stuff. But the one thing I don't really like. Is how these these are stairs you guys will see in a second. These are actually stairs right here, and they look they look strange. The lighting looks really strange on them, and I do not know why. I think I think that just might be a bug uh, that they need to fix. Um, but these are stairs up here too, and those aren't glitched out, so I don't know why these two are different. Um, I don't know if it's something I'm doing wrong, or if it's the lighting, or or something. But anyways, um, same thing here. Look, there's stairs over there, and they look all they look all screwed up for some reason. Uh, I don't get that. But anyways along here so I got the floor done um, I decided we go we would go with some checkerboard kind of pattern here which this is what you see here um, I don't I don't know I like it uh, I think it turned good um, I replaced this this used to be just a cobblestone stairway thing here and I replaced it with uh, with half slabs uh, the whole thing's made out of half slabs and double half slabs so I like that looks really good um, it has a nice flow to it but obviously I haven't gotten this part done yet um, but what I have done is I have actually done some uh, some work on these arches here, and I, li I like the, the the outlook or the outcome of this. Uh, I think it turned out pretty good. Um, but the one thing I think we need to add. So this is what I meant by detail. Let me run over here. I have some stuff in my place. Uh, ooh, and let me show you guys this right here. Um, I actually think I came up with something. Uh, this might have been done before, but uh, what it is? These are Ender Pearl stations. Um, I was I saw in Doc M's video, um, one of his older videos, that he he needs he had the same thing too with um he needed Ender Pearl stations. But the way he had his set up, I he didn't really show how to build it. So I kinda had to come up with my own way. And I think this turned out pretty good because this doesn't just work with Ender Pearls, you can do it with any single block and it dispenses ten at a time and it does it rapidly. And I'll show you what I mean by this. Um, you simply come up here, stand on the pressure plate and it feeds you nine counting the tenth one is the one when you step off of it and it launches another one and basically how this thing works is there is a clock behind this and when you step on the pressure plate um, that starts the clock and the clock eventually burns out which uh, that's when you when you stop at nine and then when you step off it gives you that tenth one so that's how this thing works um, I could make a tutorial if you guys really want me to um, but I, I doubt anybody would but if you do um, make sure to let me know because I wouldn't want to leave anyone in confusion on how I did this uh, cuz it's no secret I'm not I'm not the best with redstone and 
I think I think that's actually pretty good in my book. But anyways, here, okay. So move it along. Um, okay. Uh, I've been enchanting a lot of stuff, and I actually got Silk Touch uh, on a majority of my stuff, and that really that really made my day when I first got Silk Touch. Um, I've just been enchanting nonstop. Like I would make ten ten picks at once, and I would just enchant them all at level thirty. And you have a pretty great chance of getting Silk Touch uh, with an Iron Pick. I don't know about Diamond Pick. I know you have to get like fifty or something for a Diamond Pick, but anyways, here let's see. I don't have leaves in one of right here. Leaves. Um, so I want to add leaves under here. Let's see. Okay. So I think these are these will be good detail. Um, I don't know though. I'm still I still I gotta put it there first because I don't want to just make a decision. So we'll see. We'll put these here. Um, I did I did the same kind of thing at my uh, house in town. And speaking of, I've actually been working on a huge wheat tower. Um, I was watching uh, Suzuma's. I think that's how you pronounce it. Suzuma Void's uh, tutorial on how to do that. And boy, that thing is really efficient. You get like, it, it's not even completely done. You get like uh, two stacks of, of bread, as you see here. And, uh, and, and and more on top of that, the more layers you put. But uh, anyways, I don't know about this. Uh, one thing, oh, you know what? I think we could add this. Watch, hold on. Uh, let me grab this. Oh, God. Oh, God. I can't, I can't play. Oh, jeez. All right. Okay, so um, I think glowstone would look good under that. Let me grab that. I know I have glowstone in one of my chests here. God damn, <sighs> zombies! I hate I hate how they can break through doors. That at first I didn't really mind it that much. It, it was annoying at first, but now it's just pissing me off how they always break down doors. Um, I thought it was if it was just if you're in the building that they break your doors, but that's that's wrong. You have to be in the chunk. And they'll break down your doors, which is kind of a bitch, because my door is always missing in town. And that pisses me off, because uh, I always have to replace it. Let me see, I know I have glowstone. And right here, glowstone. Okay, so let's see here. Um, all right, jumping over here. Um, but other than other than this uh, courtyard thing here, uh, I haven't done much, uh, really. Let me see, okay. So now we get now we just gotta see how those things look. Uh, do I don't have any dirt on me. No, I do not. Let me throw something away over here. I don't need spider eyes, although they are edible. <laughs> Let me see this here. I'll grab that. Okay, so we'll see how the glowstone looks under that. Looks like under that. Um, I kind of, I'm kind of liking that. I think we might roll with it. I think this grass right here, since it's, just, it's dirt and it hasn't, the grass hasn't grown over yet, it looks weird, but I'm liking that. That looks really good. That looks awesome. Um, I could add, like, vines over here to give it a more, uh, you, it's not as see-through. Or, or trap doors, but, okay, so let's do this to all of them here. Um, alright, so let's see. Uh, glowstone, alright. Um, yesterday, I was brushing my teeth uh, cause I, I've actually gotten good height. I've been trying to get better on my hygiene, uh, teeth wise. As I said before, I have, oh crap. Do I have, I have a silk touch shovel. Yep. Using shovels on that. Okay. Okay. Anyways. Um, so I was brushing my teeth. Like I, like I said, uh, last episode, I was, I have really bad, um, teeth hygiene and I have eight cavities, <laughs> but anyways, um, so I was brushing my teeth and I am deathly, deathly afraid of spiders. I, I honestly, they're my biggest fear, um, and thinking about it now, like, it's only when I see a spider that I get all, get all scared, um, cause right now I'm just like, oh, spiders, they're not that big of a deal, but it's weird, um, because when a spider shows up, I'm, I literally shit my pants, cause I get so scared of, uh, of spiders, they really, I don't know, something about them, just, they're so disgusting and weird, I, I don't know, um, I know everyone has their fears, um, some people have snake fear. Although I don't, I don't really have, I'm not really scared of snakes at all. I know some people are like super scared, but uh, I guess it's just it's different for everyone, um, depending on who you are and and uh, what what disgusts you or or creeps you out. But okay, and yeah, so I was looking in the mirror and uh, ooh, pandas on. Hey, um, so I was looking in the mirror and right behind me, I see this huge ass. I, I don't know what kind of spider. I think it was a black widow or something. Uh, we get we get gnarly freaking black widows back. They're huge. We get huge black widows um, over here, uh, and they scare the crap out of me. So I saw it, and it, 
right behind me I could see the the goddamn spider um just speaking about spiders <laughs> um I just saw it go coming from the ceiling down and it looked like I wanted to bite my face so I quickly ran out of the room but the only thing that I really don't like is you actually have to kill the spider and that's always that's always hard because it's so weird having to get your hand close to the spider <laughs> that's always death death I feel like I'm gonna die pretty much uh, I just realized how many vines were here there is a bunch of vines I didn't realize how much there were I knew there were, I knew there were vine, vines here but damn they're really growing I'll have to get rid of these trees but I won't do that right now um, okay so let's see what are they talking about uh, school okay all right, so moving along here. Um, well, let me get a sip of Sprite. I know I don't really like people taking taking sips in their videos, but I'm gonna do that right now. Mm. Oh, I love Sprite. Um, I do like Sprite, but I kind of like Dr Pepper a little bit more, um, in my opinion. Uh, I just like the the flavor, I guess. Um, although that brings me to another topic. I don't really like Coke. I'd prefer Pepsi. And I know a lot of people are like, there's no difference. Come on, doggy. Go get it. Get it, Spanky. Kill it. I'll kill this one. You get that one. Come on, let's do it. Okay, guess not. Damn, lazy ass dog. Um, <laughs> anyways, um, I prefer Pepsi over Coke. Because uh, for some reason, um, I, I I don't like the taste of Coke. It gets it gets really strong and, and bitter after a while. And that's always annoying. But... Um, so yeah, I prefer Pepsi. Pepsi, I can drink the whole can and not not feel like I'm about to throw up. Uh, I usually give give half to somebody else, <laughs> which I don't get how they do, cause I I would be pretty afraid of germs. Uh, although they do like kind of know me. It, it depends. It always depends. I don't know. A lot of things depend on what kind of person you are and, and stuff like that. So let me see. I'm I'm liking how these things are looking. After the grass comes over it, that's looking good. And at night, I have a feeling it's gonna look better. Too bad I didn't really get to look at it at night. Well, so yeah, that's uh, that's that. Damn spider eye, I don't need you. Alrighty. I noticed that there's a bug with with burning animals. They seem to to take take a while to, for the animals to actually burn up, cause it's glitched or something. They take they always take a second to uh to kind of comprehend with the game and and actually light them on fire. And that can get annoying sometimes, because they can kill you. And then, after you die, that's when they light on fire. <laughs> and that's always... That always sucks. Let me see, what am I... What was I getting? I was going to get something. Oh, vines, here we go. I don't know how many I need, so I'll just bring bring all 24. Okay, let's see. Move it along here. Um, okay, so I got a bit of an interesting story to tell. I think right now is a good time to actually uh, let this story be told. Um... So the story starts off like this. Uh, me and a couple buddies of mine, uh, we went we went to uh, Six Flags, uh, which is over here. Uh, it's about a good hour away from us. Um, but we went to Six Flags, and uh, we, we had a good time there. Good stuff. Uh, although I did, I think I did puke after, because I rode this one spinning ride like 50 times in a row. And I, I'm really motion, I get really motion sick really easy. So do I not have... I don't have shears on me. Oh well, screw it. Um, let me actually. I should probably make a farm. But uh, anyways, um, so we're driving home. Um, nothing, nothing really interesting. Uh, we pass by this park, and then this is where the interesting stuff comes up. Um, we pass by this park, and uh, basically, um, we see this see this black woman. Um, she's is this? Yeah, okay. She's uh she's walking across the street. Not nothing really. Uh, nothing really. Um. Uh, what is it? Suspicious about that or or anything? Uh, she's crossing the street. We don't we don't really pay attention much of it. And uh, and this was this uh, this all happened a couple seconds. So keep that in mind. And I kid you not, she walked over to the park. She pulled down her pants, and that fucking lady took a piss. She she took a piss right on like the play structure of where the kids play, like. That's the most insane thing, and this was this was at night, um, so this wasn't really there was no kids at the park. That would have been that would have been really weird. I might have to might have had to call someone, <laughs> cause uh, I don't know. But I I I'm not even kidding. She she took a piss right there, and 
we we just started laughing so hard it was not even funny because i mean when are you ever going to see a lady randomly cross the street and take a piss right there i that's it, it was disgusting and kind of funny at the same exact time because like we didn't we we didn't really, really even think much of it when she was crossing the street we're just like oh okay well just a black lady crossing the street nothing much uh do i have any more here's those shears um but anyways i made i just made this, this little farm here um but yeah that was insane i'll never forget that that was so insane uh did Versh? oh Versh was here i didn't even notice Versh was here oop kind of missed that um but okay so i think we need to work on the actual second part of this um so let me grab some whatchamacallit what are these things called stone bricks there you go um can I, i'm kind of scatterbrained today uh it's been a long day we had a had a three-day weekend because of memorial day um boy going back to, to to working that's always that's always hard um that that transition is always rough but okay let me see do i have any i probably i probably passed yep stone bricks here we go um i gotta really start storing oh, damn it i gotta really start storing my stuff away i get so so cluttered with things i know i have do i not apparently i don't okay i got a gold record by the way um monkey monkey dk he has a chest full of free records. I guess he had a, a record farm made, but let me see. What what don't I need? Um, okay. Put that there. That. Oop, not that. Yeah, let's put that. That. Uh, don't need this, so we'll throw this, throw this out here. Um, okay. Uh, what else? What else? Let me cook this. Boo. Whoa. Burp. Okay, here we go. Four in there. And then I got apples and stuff for me. Okay, so I think we're good on that. Um, let's take some stone bricks with us. Uh, these... I know I had the stone stairs in one of these chests. And yeah, by the way, I got mushroom uh, mushroom blocks. These things are weird because when you break them, they come in different pieces. And I'll use this for an example. So if I take this this like top where the top is red, and uh, if I take this where the, where the whole thing's white and it's like a... I don't know how to explain it. Um, so these are two different, like, you would think these are two different blocks. But let's say I want another one of these blocks. All I have to do is stack this white one on top of this one. And it gives me two. So these things work really weird. I don't get that. And they glitch out a lot. I d See, I, I don't get that. It's weird. It's super weird. I don't know if it's preventing me from doing that or what. what's up with that. But it's strange. Uh, me and Bobo were, were discussing that. Uh, my apology if that didn't make any sense at all. Uh, okay, anyways, here, let's see, um, I'll work on this over here, um, but I think I've been rambling a bit too much right now, um, I'll actually start working on the walls over here, I'll start clearing all this stuff out, and, uh, I'll be right back once I get that done, so, see you guys in a second. Alright, so, um, this is what I got, uh, I'm not 100% sure about the length, um, I definitely, I think I'm going to need to increase it. Um, I'm thinking to maybe back there. God damn, there's too many mobs spawning. It's too dark. I really got to start lighting everything up. I've already died like three times from creepers and, and endermen and stuff. I don't have any armor. Um, I don't, I don't really like using armor while I'm, uh, while I'm around my place. I don't really mind if I die, uh, as long as if I'm close by. It's only if I go in like a cave or something I put, uh, I put armor on. But anyways, um, so that's what I got. Uh, I did do the floor. I just got to do the windows and the roof, um, and also extending it. Um, but anyways, uh, I think this is a good time to call it an episode. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the episode, please leave a like. And uh, if you want to get notified when a new video comes out, uh, feel free to subscribe. So anyways, guys, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, see ya.